Welcome back, everyone. My name is Brian Roshetsky. Thanks again for watching another episode. If you're subscribed and tuning in again from last week, thank you so much for your support. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit that bell notification so you'll be notified when my next video comes out. And to all my Patreon supporters, thank you so much for your support. I want to shout out to my newest Patreon, Devin. Thank you very much for helping me grow and supporting my channel. And for everyone else out there, if you find that this video does bring you value, think about supporting me on Patreon as well. There's a link in the description. And don't forget, the best way to support me is simply watching my videos and sharing my content. Thanks again for watching, and let's get into today's video. I have a great one in store for you today. We're gonna fly in and check out the Gigapress that's currently been unloaded. We're gonna fly around with some amazing contrast with this partly cloudy day, and check out the fast construction going on over Giga Texas. Let's check it out. Get ready, because what you're about to see quite possibly might be the start of the first drillings going in to the battery facility section of Giga Texas. Now this isn't confirmed, but that is tremendous news if this is where the 4680 battery cells will be produced here in Austin, Texas. This is just amazing. We're talking game-changing technology that could disrupt global fossil fuel industries globally. Once these batteries are deployed and we have millions and millions of electric cars driving around, holding and storing this energy, the implications could be global. One thing is very clear. I have never been more excited to step foot into the future. What I love is that witnessing this shows hundreds of years of engineering technology being pushed to its limits to create a new technology, a future technology that could be powered with abundant free energy. I guess it's time to get the drone out. Let's fly off and see what Terra Texas looks like from above. With Tesla stock news, this week was pretty slow. I predicted it before that we wouldn't see much movement, a little bit of volatility, but we did close higher, right around $846. And I believe next week is gonna be the week to watch. We have an earnings report coming out. I believe we may hear updated information with the Cybertruck, maybe some updated photos with the Cybertruck. That is what I'm looking for. And Elon Musk, if you're watching or listening, please, I hope for the Midgate. What we're looking at here is what I believe is one piece of a Gigapress. If you know in the comments more about the Gigapresses, feel free, leave it in the comment, let us know. I believe this is one of about four or five pieces that will fit together on top of the concrete foundations which will form the Gigapress.
It won't be long now, and these two still buildings will be joining. Looks like the concrete structure is almost finished. The work that they've accomplished in a day, again, amazing. They've almost completed the entire top of the concrete structure. To me, normally this is the best angle of the building. It really just shows the insane perspective of how enormous Terra, Texas is. The trench that is making that center line right down the middle of the Gigafactory is now extended almost the entire way, which just to make it clear, is over a football field in length. Now what we're flying over here is about to ramp up its construction. This here is the general assembly area as we move on to the loading dock area. I really wanted to get more of these guys attaching this beam, but I am sorry, my battery was dying and sometimes just timing doesn't work out for things. Oh, there goes another battery. Time to land. Swap the battery out. I want to give a shout out to uh, the quad squad and all the drone pilots and uh, photographers and filmers that are, you know, hanging out around this place. Um, your dedication is amazing. I can't believe 
how hard it is to keep up with this every single day. Uh, thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I'll keep these videos coming uh, as long as people keep watching and enjoying this content. Shout out to Jack and Gail. Uh, Gail showed up and hung out with us all day here. And uh, Jack, I've seen him many times here. He actually makes a drive all the way from Dallas to film this stuff. So please check out his channel as well. And uh, check out uh, all the channels. Why not? Uh, it's an amazing adventure. This is history in the making. And I'm just so happy to be a part of it. Uh, again, thanks for watching. Um, and stay tuned for the next one. Thanks again. Cheers. You know, you really don't get to film everything here and you do miss a lot of stuff that you really wanted to get. But right here, you'll see my but right here. You'll see my last clip um, where they started to load the GigaPress onto the foundation. So maybe tomorrow when I come back, you'll see um, most of the GigaPress actually on one of those foundations. So we'll have to wait and see. See you next time.